Hayward pool heater display is blank power is on to heater pump is running just filled propane tank and valve is on. Welcome to Just Answer. Sorry to hear that your heater is giving you problems. It sounds like there may be a problem with the main power coming into the unit. Some heaters have a switch on the door that will prevent startup if the access door is opened. Can you get me the model number of the heater? This way I can check the wiring diagram to see if there are any fuses or other links that may be preventing the power from getting to the control panel. The unit is only a year old. I hooked it up myself. I have not touched anything since I ran it last year without any problems. I can pull the panel and check for power but the same circuit feeds the pump. I'll get you the model hash. Be right back. Okay, you may want to open the access panel and inspect inside. Sometimes rodents like to make this area a home, and it is possible that they have chewed through some wires. Hayward H350 FDP I checked the access panel. I am accessing the manual now. The wires look good and I checked the voltage with my meter and that looked good. Please stand by. Still looking at diagram. Looks like they sell a fuse kit for the heater. I'm not sure where the fuses are to check them. There is a fuse panel location on the manual that I am looking at. I will need you to check the low voltage fuse, it is a simple spade type automotive fuse. Let me get you a link to this manual and a page number, it shows where the fuse panel is located. I have the manual up on another computer. Just let me know the page number. HTTPS colon slash www.haywardpool.com slash PDF slash manual slash universal series loan ox hex service and installation dot PDF. Page number? I'll pull the panel and look. The page is 33. The figure is 25. It is the second photo. There are several fuses on this board, and all should be checked. The 3 amp low voltage fuse is the most common one to go, since it is a fast acting fuse. Pages 54 and 55, of this service manual will give you the troubleshooting steps to go into if the fuses are in fact all good. It will detail where to check for power supply at what connections etc. The spade type fuse is good the other glass tube fuse is good. You may want to pull the fuses and check them with an ohm meter for continuity, sometimes the fuse looks good, but there is a small fault that is not allowing power through. I'm not a technician and there may be more fuses that I can see. I'll have to call to get someone out here to check it out. If the unit is less than a year old, it should be under warranty, but yes, it sounds like either a fuse or a transformer. There are several parts that can cause this to happen, but it needs to be checked with a multimeter, there are simple steps and guidelines for a tech to do this. Good luck with this, and if you decide to check it out yourself, or have any other questions, I will be happy to help you if possible. Thanks for using Just Answer. Our chat has ended, but you can still continue to ask me questions here until you are satisfied with your answer. Come back to this page to view our conversation and any other new information. What happens now? Or, you can reply to me using the box below.
If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.